Hello everyone, today I'll be showing off a, a pretty interesting shoot em up for, for y'all. This is Summer Carnival 92 Record. This was originally made for like a for like a contest and it has a like a very score type vibe to it. Why is my controller not working? Oh my gosh, I, I need to like figure my Oh, I don't have I'm not in inside the game. That explains it. <laughs> anyway, I'll I guess I'll start, I'll just, I'll kind of warm up with like a normal game, but even that is pretty, it's definitely a thing. Aw, oh, thanks, Flagon. But yeah, anyway, so this is just kind of your typical shim up there. It's like a really impressive plat, like a pretty, really impressive shim up at the time. Like, it like, is able to manage like a lot of stuff on screen, so it's really neat. And so, eh. Oh my gosh, I'm just gonna reset. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't know, I don't wanna live like that early, honestly. But yeah, anyway, so... Ship Hot Jams. Yeah, there's some pretty cool music in this game. I guess this is my, kind of my favorite power-up to get. It, this, like, shoots, like, everywhere. And, uh... Oh. I wanted to get the... BS power, but that, like, it tracks enemies, so it's really cool to have, but I miss it, unfortunately. And, like, after you do that, like, there'll be more. Uh, yeah, that, that can just, like, track enemies. And you also gain points for, like, whenever you're not, not shooting the main weapon. So, for score attacking, you'll want to try not to shoot it unless you have to to clear out enemies that you wouldn't otherwise clear out. But, you can use, like, the the secondary weapon, like this. It's, like, tracking all the enemies. Oh, heck. Oh. There's, like, a lot of stuff. Uh, so, um... Okay, that'll be fine, I guess. I was hoping to maybe... Like, get, you can get like 10,000 points if you already have the max level of power-up if you, if you get another power-up after that. And so, generally, so one really cool, so if you like let the energy go up to the max, you can, you can shoot a bomb in. One really cool property about the bomb is that it can actually block shots, so you'll definitely want to have that. Oh, and I'm, I'm so sorry that I didn't say this verbally, but there's a lot of flashing and flickering in this game, so... Definitely be aware of, of that. It, it, the flickering isn't as much right now, but the, in the later stuff I'm going to show off, there's a lot more flickering. Oh, heck. Uh, okay, that was scary. <laughs> oh yeah, this is definitely really impressive. Oh wow, I don't usually get the hoeing power up, honestly. Okay, that's pretty good power to have. Like, the max level walk like, walking power up. That's what I generally try to get for score attack, because it's a little more powerful than the F power up. Uh, oh. Ah! The max level misses, or I don't think this is the max level laser, but I can get the max level in a little bit, I think. Because there's like a lot of power ups you can get really quickly, so it's really neat. Pretty soon, I'll, I'll need to try to have a bomb charged up for the boss coming up. I'm trying to keep my speed low so that I can easily, like, go through this. This is honestly a really tricky boss for me. You have to really react quickly to be able to do it. So. I lost quite a few lives there, but that's fine. There is a level select that I can that I can use. Later on, if I, if I need to, I'll probably end up using that, honestly. I don't like only having two lives left coming into this level. But hey, we'll see how this goes. <laughs> scary, oh my gosh. Uh, okay, I'm not gonna really be able to get that, unfortunately. It's like it's so hard to dodge if you don't... Like, you gotta do it. If you, like, don't get it when it's... Up above you, when it's like in front of you. That's what the backward power is pretty helpful for, but in the end I still think other power are generally better. 
like the other secondary parts are better. I, I keep forgetting to get the power that I want to get, so this might be bad. Ah, uh, uh, still. It's, oh, okay, I got another life earlier. Just check this. And like the timer also goes on as you're pausing. So, okay, so we're moving out. We're gonna be facing a snake in a little bit. Uh... Oh, wow. And so I'm just gonna be wanting to repeatedly use the bombs for this part. Oh wow, this is actually my last life. This is still a decent performance, I guess. I hope I can beat this level, but I don't know if it's that likely. Ah, I was really wanting to get the best level for the blazer, but unfortunately it switched to, uh, like, that one. Uh, I got I got this at least. Maybe I can do this. So many of these, oh my gosh. Uh, Hopefully I can do this. There, yeah, there's just like so, so much here. It, this isn't like, like, there'll be like more later. If there gets to be like even more, I'll be showing off like other difficulties and other modes of this. After, after, I'll probably use level select to get back to level 3 yeah, if I, after I finish here. Ooh, I didn't want to get that. No, that started me off at the, at the, the first level of the Vulcan. Uh, I'm gonna increase my hands. Uh, you can, like, press select to increase that. Oh, heck. That's game over. Oh, that was, that was, that was, that was pretty good, I guess. Like, I tried... Uh, I've made it to level 3 before on, like, one credit, but that's still pretty good. That's, like, about... Probably about 70 or 80% of the way through the second level. Oh wait, no. Uh, I actually like double press start. I need to remember like how to do the how to do the cheat. So okay. So let's see. Yeah, this is a lot of fun. So wait, no, that's not. This stage select is surprisingly tricky to do. Oh wait, no, I need to hold select as well. So I need to hold start and then... Oh no, I better not have pressed that. And then that'll let me start from the other levels. And actually a lot of the... A lot of the other modes are lots behind like... Like button codes as well. So this is the third level. Uh no. I guess I, ha I haven't even seen too far into this, so this is going to be kind of blind for me, so we'll see how this goes. Maybe I should actually try to find the Infinity Life Sheet, because it gets really tricky around here. I guess I can just kind of try this all for a few minutes and see how well, I, how far I can get here. 
Oh no, yeah. I'll see. I'll I'll try probably try this for a little bit and then maybe move on to showing off the fourth level. What? Oh right, I shouldn't have unpressed select. Oh my gosh, the the stage select is just the hardest thing. I guess I guess it's just automatically has it there, so that's cool. Or maybe I just always start there, even like after after I game over. That'd be pretty cool. Ah, uh, I was I maybe I should be honestly be trying so hard to maybe it's just focus more on surviving like like yeah. Okay, this one will better at least. Okay, uh, probably should have focused on keeping that. Oh yes, never mind, that's really cool. Not too last left, so this attempts looking a little bit better. I think this is the mini boss. This boss just shoots like a lot of bullets. Okay, that was actually a lot closer than I wanted it to be. And definitely flashing warning for because like after I defeat every boss, generally there's a flashing warning just because that's just like unfortunately I love this game, but. There is, like, a lot of flashing. It'd be really nice if, like, there wasn't quite as much, but that's how this game is, unfortunately. Ah, uh, oh no. Please, I beat this. Ah, that was... Oh, I gotta let Bart part of that time, at least. Okay, I think we'll show off the fourth level now, because I got relatively far there. Start select. Still press. Okay, so level four. This is level that I honestly have not seen at all. So we'll see how this goes. Oh heck. I'm also going to be showing off like a hard mode after this. Oh, this is like a boss rush. I'm going to have to deal with this boss again. A lot of fun. I almost was able to use that bullet for that. Okay. I think I already lost a lot of lives, unfortunately. Yeah, I'm already on my final line. That boss is a little bit tricky. Ah. Oh right, I should, I, I'm just gonna be trying on try level 4 for a little bit. I'm trying to keep that like that for the boss thing, but I never quite managed to do that. It's so hard to navigate with. 
Okay, that was actually a lot better that time. Oh, this is like a boss that you do in like score attack and time attack, but it's really not that tricky. And as I say that, I almost die. <laughs> Oh, I didn't want to get that. It's... I was thinking, I mean, from the, the Lol 2 version of the Vulcan Cannon Power Up. Just showing how I had the boss. You can do it a little fast by shooting the bottom of it earlier if you're like doing like a speed run, but here I just kind of do that for safety. And also, you may notice like the in game timer is actually moving a little faster than real time because, and, the, and that's just because like I think just a frame rate was patched, like it's like the timer move, moves in 60 FPS, but the game runs at 50 or something like that. It's like a uh, six five ratio, so something like that probably. Ah, hmm. almost got that. Here you need to like just wait for these the rods here to be in a certain way that you can, you can get the boss, and then you need to use the bomb here. Maybe I'll actually manage to finish this. I don't know if it's that one, but that'd be pretty cool. <laughs> so I'm finding her life pretty soon. Yep. I didn't want to get the humming one, actually. I'll try to get pretty close, at least. Yeah, yeah, there's like a lot of flashing, yeah. It's only just after every boss is generally when it's the when it's like the worst, but there's flashing other places as well, I'm pretty sure. Uh I guess I'll get the next level for this one. I keep forgetting which power for when I get fire. Oh, that, I can't really get in there. Okay, there you are. I actually kind of want to focus on using the bombs. I just have to get a lot of damage off there at the beginning. Uh, hope I can get him on this life. Uh, okay, good. I think this might be my last life. Uh, oh. I'm gonna try to do this. Like, it just moves around, and I'm trying to use, like, bombs when I can. Just steal damage. There we go. How many lives have left? Okay, so I still have another one. So, maybe I can do this. Oh, I didn't, I didn't really want that, honestly. I think I'm gonna, like, play this path that'll be pretty good, though, to have. Because it's really powerful. That one! Oh no, that one just sucked me around. Uh, okay, that's... That was still a pretty good attempt of that, of that fourth level, I think, so... 
So now I'm gonna move on to like hard mode. Like some hard mode levels. That would be that would that's what would be the last level of normal mode, which is only available in this game. Oh I, I did the level select wrong. What else is new? Do I need to depress start? Wait no, I need to depress Err <laughs> Soul Side always confuses me. <laughs> okay there. Oh, yeah, I really hope that there, yeah, uh, I know Flashing Patch would be really nice for this game. But yeah, this is like hard mode. This is, and this is a, one that you can only unlock via cheat code in the original game. There is like a, a, a like a, a mod of this that, that restores those. Oh, three yes versions of those flashing that's pretty neat. Okay, so now I at least have this, so this could be pretty, pretty good. I'm just gonna keep this so I can make sure to destroy them as quickly as I can. Oh no. Let's see how far I'm getting in hard mode. Hopefully this goes better. I like that my first attempt in normal mode. This is going pretty well so far. If only. I wonder what would go into like making a patch like that. I don't know. This is definitely a game that would benefit a lot from it. And like here there and there's also quite a bit of flickering. It's honestly not that bad considering just how much is on the screen, but there's still a lot of it later on in a later mode that I'm gonna sh show off. I guess what I could do is just it's just stop when I know I'm about to beat the boss, maybe, and just go go on to the next level. I mean, even then, it just so because the flashing is just so intense after I defeat a boss, uh, I can just kind of show off how the boss works, I guess, maybe, and that would help with like the flashing. There's still other places where it flashes, but when you defeat the bosses, is definitely by far the most significant. So. Oh, this is not going that well, honestly. Oh, cool. Yeah, that would definitely be awesome. Okay, honestly, I know I can do better than that. I want to try that again. <laughs> I've like, I've, it's like, I think the third level in Harpo before. I like the third areas on like one credit. So, I kind of want to do, do better than that, I think. Maybe try just try getting like a little. Okay, well this game's wanted me to get the V power for a lot apparently. So I guess I'll try that again. Yeah, this is definitely a game. It's definitely fast going for like as good of a score as I can. I would be trying to not be using, trying to occasionally not use the Vulcan, but I think I'm just gonna stick with it for now.
Okay, so I have five last place, so this is still going to be well. This is still the first, like, part of the power up. Ah. Uh... Oh, gotcha. That. Don't worry, that's understandable. Ah, uh, I didn't really want to get that. Like, it helps, but it really, like, if it's, like, directly to the right of you, you can't even, like, really, it really can't even reach the enemy, so it's not really that helpful, honestly. I want to see if I can get the S. Okay, yes, that's good to get. Okay, at least got a, got, I got a better version of that power. Okay, now I have a, a second level. Of this, so that's good. Okay. As I say that that happens, that I didn't, I lose the power I wanted, but this still is pretty good. Okay, getting pretty close to the end, end of this level. Yes. Uh... Oh, and I'm gonna get an off as well, so that's really cool. Let's see if I can get the S power up. I oh, can't quite get it. So. And then just a lot of these enemies here. Ah, I just barely missed that. Okay, close to a million, so that's cool. Okay, here's a good chance to get that power up. Okay, this attempt, this hard mode attempt one better, so that's cool. Think about a million handing in dinner is pretty good. Oh! I ended up destroying that boss, uh, Honestly, it's kind of playing on not destroying those bosses just because of all the flashing, but... I kind of forgot how that works, so... Sorry. I will warn, like, when I'm gonna be doing, like, a time attack and score attack pretty soon, I'm gonna be showing that off, and there, there will be quite a bit of flashing. I'll probably show that off after, after I show this off a little bit longer. Hmm. Maybe I have to get the second, second boss here, I'll, I'll switch to, like, doing, like, like, kinda, like time attack attempts. It's like another mode of like a time attack. Maybe it's also the final level car mode. I haven't actually seen it any, but I'm sure it's a, it's a thing. I'm. S How did I not, not die there? Yeah, this is where the, it starts kind of getting a little flickery because there's like so many bullets. Oh wow, I'm completely well with lives, honestly. Yeah, it's like at the point where it's like not showing lives I get. I don't think I get them either, though.
Oh, heck. Okay, at least there's another life there, but I did lose the power I wanted, but luckily there's enough enemies. I, I didn't want to get that. I actually want to get the V one again. Uh, Oh, uh, I'm sorry, though. Like, if you, if you lose one life, it can be a little punishing, honestly, because, like, you have to read to get your power-ups, and with how many bullets are, it can... you can just die a whole lot. And I'm all, Okay, I got the second level of the uh, V, so that really does help. I can skip the S secondary weapon here. I'll be good. Okay, good. Oh, wow. Okay, I'm just gonna not even do that boss because they're, it's a pretty simple boss and like... I'll be showing it off later anyway, and I just don't want to... And I kind of want to avoid flickering when I can. Uh, so... I'm press that... Maybe, and... All six. Oh wait, no, that'd be all seven. That would be the next level. It's 11 through. It's. I'm about 27 more minutes. Hmm. I think I'll do one like time attack attempt. For the next half hour or so, there will be a lot of flashing lights, so just a warning. I don't think that having hard mode changes the time attack. I know it's in the mod that I used to play that, that unlocks everything, so. I don't think I'll do it here. So I want to get. Oh heck, I missed that. That's bad. I'm gonna reset over that. Oh, hey, Arby! Hey, Arby, Elia, thanks for the raid! Good luck on your number much much fun coming up. That'll be a lot of fun. I guess, just a warning to everyone coming in, this game does have, like, a lot of, like, flashing lights and flickering. The flicker will be so apparent, yeah, but it will be lighter. But, every time I defeat a monster, there'll be, like, a lot of of flashing lights, so definitely be aware if you that that's kind of a thing with this gang. Okay, this isn't one. That's what I want to, but I should hopefully be able to at least complete it. Hopefully get a pretty decent time. I usually like having like the V power up here. Oh no, I lost one power. Like, if, if any of these, like, power up the blue wing power ups leave the screen, it'll, like, reset. Like, for each one you get, it'll cause you to get more points for each one you, you get, but I haven't want any of them leave the screen causes the amount you get to reset, so you have to be careful with that. Okay, got those enemies on. Uh, uh, oh, I missed that. So my goal is to get about 800,000 by the time I finish, by the time I finish a later part, by the time I finish the second boss coming up. Oh, thanks for good luck. <laughs> okay, so, no, I didn't want to get that one. I'm not really on that good score pick pace, but as long as I, I can still do relatively well, I should at least be able to complete this mode. After five minutes, I'll it'll say time up. And I even though this is may not be paced to like beat it after the second boss. Ah, uh, okay. Okay, Code Man, thanks for some by. <laughs> yeah, this game's definitely pretty flashy. Uh I keep not knowing which power I want to get. This isn't- I don't think this is really paced to- to have enough points to just clear it after the second level, but... But 
I'll at least buy fair. I'll need about to have oh, about 920,000 actually for being the second boss to be kind of a shot at any mats. Oh no. Didn't do that at the right time. That is really, really bad. Uh. Okay, we also be able to do it actually. This isn't as good score pace as I'd want, but this, it'd still be doable so for me to at least complete it. In like the, the in like five minutes. This is like about a 412.62. By just feeding it after defeating the second boss as like the last one. Oh, oh no, this could actually be pretty close. Uh, I want to defeat this as quickly as I can. So what I'm gonna do is like do that and then I should be able to defeat it with the iframes, hopefully. Okay, good. Yeah, there's a lot of flashing after each boss, but. 912,000, I might be able to do this. It depends on how this goes. I need to get a million in, well, it's in like five minutes of going to the in-game timer. Which, unfortunately with how this is going, I don't quite do, but... I mean, we'll do it, we'll see. If I can get a lot more of these, maybe I can. This is really what I need? Oh my gosh, I was so close! I, I like intentionally ran into the enemy but just so that I could like so that I could like get get the points more quickly but I didn't realize I was on my last life so heck but anyway so let me see reset the game I'm gonna show off Zanki mode I'm gonna attempt to beat it there will also be a lot of flashing lights for this and a lot of flickering as a word of warning beat the set the game hold A and B Wait, no. Press and hold start button. Press and hold up and select. What? That didn't work. I'm I guess I could just show off, like, the mod that, like, that, like, just automatically unlocks it. Um, oh, that's not right. What? No. Oh. So there should probably be enough time to like do this, I think. Uh, wait, no, not this one. Okay, this one, yeah. This is like a... You can find this on like romhacking.net. Uh, and so this is a mode... You can actually start with 50 laps in this, but... Every enemy that you destroy, like... Also... If you just want an enemy, like a lot of bullets go out of of it of it of them. So so that is a little tricky. So the only the strat is like try to keep the bomb whenever you can. Okay, and also you you will want to destroy enemies just so you can get some extra lives. Like you just kind of want to use back for the bomb block shot. So having the S power up here is really good. Yeah, this is where there where there's kind of a lot of flickering. And sometimes enemies can spawn lives, so you'll be wanting to destroy them when you can. The other day when I was practicing, I beat this with like two lives, so hopefully I can do that th this time. I think it typically takes about twenty. It'll typically take takes about 16 minutes, so that'll probably be the last part of this presentation. Probably that'll be enough. Uh... Okay, good. I was able to destroy it before it did that. Uh... Uh... Yeah, kind of the strats just to kind of keep the bomb so that it'll block all the shots and just destroy the means when you can so, and hope that you can get a lot of extra lives. 
So having 51 locks already ready is pretty good. Honestly, I think this mode, like, it's easier to actually complete it, but the way scoring for this works is that you're ranked based on how many lives you complete it with, so... So that's how this works. You can also play this in hard mode, but I kind of want to do the one that I actually had a shot at completing, so I'm doing this one. Oh yeah, there's like a lot of flickering now, oh my gosh. Yeah. I was almost about to shoot the bomb, oh my gosh. Okay, now. I just kind of want to keep doing this. Uh... I can get here. Aww. Okay. Yeah, this well, this is like the second area, and just there's a lot of bullets. But I still have 43 lives, which is pretty good. Hopefully, I can finish like this this level fat 35 or so. It would be pretty good progress, I think. Of course, I lost power, my power ups earlier, which is uh, kind of punishing. Okay, that's gonna be good. I wasn't expecting to get me there. Okay, I was, well, at least I would get that, the, the S power up there, so that's good. Really? Yeah. Please, guy. Oh. I'm just gonna kinda try to avoid these, I think, so that I can make sure to keep on here. <sighs> okay, probably just gonna get that one. That's a pretty good power up. I would rather have the other one though. I'm not getting really many of the secondary power-ups in the position I want them in. Still 40 last at least. Oh, okay. Yeah, this, like, like, it also flickers a lot, like, when you just, like, deal damage to, like, some of the mini-bosses, so, yeah. Oh, really? That was going pretty well, too. If I can beat this level with about 38 last off, that'd be good. I think that's about how many I have in my practice.
Oh. Okay, so this is how to get Thyra. That's pretty good. And then I just ran right into the enemy right there. But yeah, we're getting close to the end. Uh, maybe I can. I should think I should be able to do this in the time. In like the next 10 minutes or so. Hopefully. This game take, take, usually takes about 22 minutes, but the in-game timer is a little, a little faster than well, 22 minutes in in-game. This work gets pretty tricky. Oh. Have lives, so this is pretty well so far. And I'll s oh no. Okay, I got to get that back at least. Yeah, like these these enemies are tricky to deal with. I like the missiles here, and like the the bombs can't block those the missiles, so that makes it pretty tricky. Actually, damage like when the the boss is there, like when you're uh, near the boss. I'm just trying to get the boss. Sometimes I do that just to make sure I can deal as much damage as I can, like during my eye frames. And sometimes with tricky bosses, that's kind of all you can do. Oh, this is stage four. Maybe I can I like finish this in time, I like the next ten minutes or so. I'll finish a little bit earlier, but we'll see how that goes. And I guess we kind of just start off with a boss rush. Having this many lives coming into here is pretty good. I think I had a lot less when doing practice. I think there's a pretty decent chance of being able to complete this. quickly. But yeah, we're just kind of be going, going to be going through a lot of other bosses in this part. So. And since it's like a boss rush, there will be a lot of flashing in the in like this level. Ooh, uh, uh, uh. Oh. 
Well, they have 23 lives left, so it's going pretty well in that regard, at least. Oh my gosh, I need to put down. This isn't even really the tricky part. Uh... Okay, so that's how I'm supposed to, to get this boss. I think it kind of like alternates the time you're like the one you're supposed to. how you're supposed to go. Okay. And this is like the hard, the boss that's on on the hard mode level. I think we're getting pretty close to the end. Just a few more bosses. I think the the boss fight is really long in this game. Wow. Oh yes, never like that is really good to get. It's like flashing lights when like you do the when you're attacking the boss, so yeah, photosensitive light mode for this game. That moves the flashing would be really neat. There is still some flickering, but it would definitely improve it quite a bit, so. <laughs> Oh this is probably the boss that I found the most tricky. Almost got the bomb off there. I think I should be able to get it get this boss on the select though. Never mind. Yeah, that boss is tricky. Yeah, probably after I finish this run, meet the end of the showcase. But I think there might only be like one or two more bosses left today. I don't remember how long this part of the game the level up thing is. Aww. Okay. the trash just to wait till you can shoot bombs at it at the bosses. Oh I'm getting this pretty quickly, that's cool. I'm gonna leave turn mode just to kinda of speed this up a little bit. Uh, oh. oh that could be out of the game. Didn't it? What no? What? What happens? My control is locked for some. Uh, at least this is the part where I'm not dying. That's that. Uh, uh, I'm gonna play on keyboard real quick, I guess. This is really improv, but my controller just suddenly stopped working. <laughs> but just kind of switch to keyboard controls real quick. I think I'm close enough that I should have a pretty good shot of beating it, even though that happened. Uh. Really, I didn't get you? I think that might be enough. I think I just do another... Okay. So I'm just turn voting through this just to kind of see what's going to come up. It doesn't really seem like a part where you really need to worry about like. 
I, like I did that once, but sometimes you can just like just like stay at stay at the bottom of the screen and you'll be fine. It's not like that all the time though. We're getting really close to the end, I'm pretty sure. I don't Oh yes, this is the final boss. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh like this. So, uh, honestly, the strat's kind of just to keep, like, running into his hitbox, and it's going to be also fun. Oh, let's go! I beat that! So that's actually the end of the run, I think. Yeah! I'm going to beat that with eight laps left, because when doing the tracks that I got only had, like, two or so left, so it's really nice to beat that with eight left. But yeah, that's thank you, but I'd really like to get to show off like the hard mode, but I think we're about out of time for the presentation, so coming up next I think we'll be having like we'll be having like Arborelia doing another month or so that'll be a lot of fun, so so we'll probably we'll, we'll probably be heading on to that now. So so thanks everyone for watching.